Ooh, he's right, they do hurt. Of course, not everyone hates acorns. They're a great source of food for wildlife, like deer, and of course, squirrels. There is some irony in the use of this boat for this purpose. Some scientists, including the Bay Foundation, now blame overfishing by the once huge fleet of skipjacks for the decline in the oyster population. The whole process only takes a couple of minutes, and when it's done, the bird is set free to continue its migration south. This is typical of the sort of property damage that you can find in Bethany Beach. Nothing real severe, but a wave did hit this building with enough force to pop a hole in the cedar siding. One major reason is that people have changed the countryside. Where these rolling hills of northern Virginia and Maryland were once densely wooded, farming and development have created a patchwork of woodlots and open fields. And that's perfect habitat for white-tailed deer. The governor also owes his victory to many of these people out here in the red and black hats. They're the supporters of Prince George's County Executive Wayne Curry. They helped turn out the vote in what has proven to be one of the most important voter-rich regions in the state. The State Highway Administration has begun plans to build an overpass to get this train away from the roads. But the people here believe it's not happening fast enough.